Uh, Eric, you guys are up five, and then Cunningham gets a three-point play. He just kind of, I guess he showed why a lot of people think he's the number one pick in the draft. Just what do you think of what he did down the stretch, kind of carrying them? Yeah, no, I mean, I thought he played 31 great minutes. Um, you know, hadn't played in two games. Unfortunately, we get him on the night he comes back, and and uh, he's a phenomenal ba he player. I mean, we, you know, played against, uh, you know, like Markel Foltz when he was the number one pick in the draft, and um, Cunningham's really, 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 really special. And then it looked like Connor got a pretty good look coming out of the timeout um, when you guys were down two. What did you think of that look? And what was the uh, what, what was the play call there? What was the strategy? Yeah, I thought he had a good look. We you know we knew that they would be you know draped over some of our other guys, and and uh, you know their centers tried to kind of clog the lane up a little bit. And uh, I thought he got a good look. Um, obviously, against a zone, you can't dictate the shot as much as you can against a a uh, a man to man, but. Um, you know, we got to look with the guy who's a, a pretty good shooter for us. And, um, you know, as in all sports, I mean, it, you can't just take the last play. I mean, it's a culmination of, you know, the first half. The second half, I, I thought we played good basketball. I thought we played good towards the last 10 minutes of the of the uh, first half as well. But, um, you know, tough loss. And I mean, you only got to take seven free throws. I'm sure you're not too happy about that. Um, what, what are your thoughts on that, I guess? Zero comment because Oklahoma State's physical. Coach. Okay, thanks. Thanks, Eric. Coach, uh, what, what did you think of the shot that Cunningham hit there with 21 seconds left? It looked like Devo was, was playing pretty good defense. Yeah, I thought we played good defense. He's just strong, tall, and just kind of rose up. But I, I wasn't upset with our defense other than the fact that we gave up two late offensive rebounds that, that Oklahoma State chased down. Good. Hey, Coach, only 15 minutes for Desi tonight. I know he had that hard fall in the Ole Miss game. Was that something that was still bothering him? No, I, I think he's physically fine. Okay, and then uh, down the stretch there, you you went with Devo, it looked like, over over Jalen Tate. You know, a, a week ago, you had to move Devo off the ball in that Auburn game, but what gave you the confidence to roll with him tonight? Yeah, I just didn't think Jalen Tate had it at all. Um, and... So we, you know, we wanted to. Debo was getting into the teeth of the defense, and and um, had, you know, I mean, that was for as far as our coaching staff's concerned, that was definitely the right move tonight. The way Tate was playing. Dudley. Coach, can you just talk a little bit about how y'all did play early in that uh, second half to kind of get back in the ball game and what y'all were doing well? I just thought, you know, I think we started getting some defensive stops. I thought we got got them off the offensive boards for for a short spurt there. Um, again, I thought our effort was there. It's it's uh, you can't miss point blank layups and beat a good team, and we've got to become better rim finishers. Scotty, hey, coach, just wanted to get your thoughts on you guys' defensive rebounding effort today, and then what made Boone and, and Moncrief a, a challenge on the offensive glass. Yeah, I don't think, I mean, Moncrief had 22 points against Iowa State the other night, so it's no surprise that, um, you know, that he played well. I mean, you know, he had six rebounds and 11 points. You, you know, you can go look at his his stat line against Iowa State. And I thought Boone was a guy that really hurt us tonight. Um, you know, that was the one guy in particular that, that I thought rose to the occasion um, for them. And, and he, you know, he kept six offensive rebounds. I mean, you just can't have that, you know, can't have that with one guy and and um but but we you know again we turned him over 19 times um you know we've got to take a little bit better care of ourselves and jd had a had a travel late game and you got to get a shot on goal at that time um that juncture in the game troy yeah coach what do you think about uh justin smith's performance today he seemed to really fill up the stat sheet well yeah, I thought Justin played phenomenal offensively, did a good job moving the ball with four assists. Uh, four turnovers is too much at, at his position. Um, we, we need him to, we, I mean, we really need him to defensive rebound with the makeup of our team. And we need him to get more than three defensive rebounds. Um, but I thought, you know, to score 18 points, four assists, I thought he, 
um, you know, played a solid offensively, you know, as he has for us. Again, we, we just need some more defensive rebounds and, and, and we got to take care of the basketball better. Randy. Eric, would you call that a typical Big 12 ball game based upon the physicality and obviously that physicality led to a lot of offensive rebounds for Oklahoma State? I mean, I, I don't coach in the, in the Big 12. I mean, I played, you know, Texas in an NCAA tournament. Uh, I thought they were really, really physical. Um, we couldn't figure out a way to get to the foul line, I guess. I didn't, I didn't know 15 three balls was a lot um, in a game. But I guess, you know, I guess we didn't go to the rim enough to, uh, you know, to, to draw fouls. Final, final question. Yeah, Eric, what did you think of Devo's play overall? You said, well, obviously, you trusted him there at the end. Yeah, I thought he played really. I mean, when you know, when you're when you're playing two freshmen down the stretch like we did. I mean, Devo, you know, he had a he had a, a shot at the rim that didn't fall. Um, Connor tried to put it back. That was a, a crucial play for us. And again, I mean, I think Devo did a great job. He gave us great energy. Uh, I thought he defended his position. He got his hands on loose balls. He got steals. I thought he played great, but. Again, we've got to finish shots at the rim. We, ha we have to become better at that.